Hi everyone, so today I want to show you some of the Caudalie products that I bought in the past like month, month and a half. Um, I made two orders on the actual Caudalie website um, around like, I want to say around the time I had the baby, late April, early May. Um, I bought three gift sets, two were the same and one was different. One gift set came with this as like the main product in it and it's the Caudalie Premier Crew um, eye cream and I had run out of my Clinique eye cream and I wanted to try this. I wouldn't recommend this. I think it is not great for your eyelid. It says you can use it on your eyelid. It's only really good for under the eye. So when I run out of this, I'm not going to repurchase it, but it came with a deluxe size or like travel size or whatever of the serum I use, which this alone is worth like $60. So that's why I thought it's a great time to try the eye cream because I know I'm going to use this mini serum. And you also got to try the Premier Crew, um, the cream, which is lovely. Um, and for those of you that have been watching me for a long time, my skin's always been combination oily. Ever since I was like probably in my second trimester of pregnancy, it's been dry. And now that the baby is out and everything is great, but I am breastfeeding, it is still dry. My obstetrician said that it's probably gonna stay like that until a few months into breastfeeding or even after I stop breastfeeding because um, your body is like missing estrogen, I think it was, or something like that, so you get dry skin. And my skin is super dry. I don't know if you can see it in camera, you probably can, but I actually have a rash on my neck still. It's a little bit of eczema. And it's because I'm breastfeeding and my skin is really dry. The other gift set that I got for myself was two of these ones and they came with the um, Beauty Elixir by Caudalie, which I love and I use this like morning and night. And so I got two of them because the gift set was worth the same price as just getting one of these. But you actually got, um, along with this, you got a travel size or mini size of the foaming cleanser. Um, which I use anyways, and I've actually used up both of the minis since I bought them So I don't have those to show you but you got this you got the foaming cleanser and you got this So I actually have two of these now and it's the detox mask, which isn't a bad mask It's not one of my favorites uh, for coat from Caudalie, but it's a really good one um, so I got those like Probably almost two months or no more than two months ago But I wanted to show them to you and then this stuff I ordered like a couple weeks ago so I needed more of my foaming cleanser, so I got the full size of that, and it's just the Instant Foaming Cleanser by Caudalie. This I absolutely love, and I noticed that I had used the two mini sizes that came in those gift sets, and I noticed that the full size, the foam is just like way better. It's like richer feeling. Um, so I'm glad I ordered the full size for myself. And then I also picked up my favorite mask, and it's the Glycolic Peel Mask. And I checked the ingredients and this seems safe for when I'm nursing. So that made me really happy because I don't know why, but I was really paranoid in my pregnancy about ingredients. And I didn't even check the ingredients on this, but I think it would have been fine. <laughs> um, so I picked this up and I love this. The thing with though, with having a new baby is you don't always have time to do a mask. <laughs> um, so when I do have time, I slap this on in the bath or shower. Because my skin has been dry, it's been a little bit flaky even, so I needed an exfoliator finally. I didn't exfoliate my face almost my entire pregnancy, I think, because I don't remember the last exfoliator that I owned. Um, but I was going to buy the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion one. I think it's Dr. Brandt. It's one of the doctor ones at Sephora, and it's called like Microdermabrasion something, and it's in a black tube. And I've used that before, and it's $98, and it's amazing. But I was feeling cheap, <laughs> and I was already ordering um, stuff from Caudalie. So I put this one in my bag, because I used this before, and I remember loving it, and I don't know why I stopped using it. And this one is like, I think $38, I want to say, and it lasts for a long time. So I picked this one up, and it's the Deep Cleansing Exfoliator. I just use this once a week, but it makes a huge difference. And then this was a sample that really surprised me that I wanted to tell you guys about. I don't know if I told you about it before because I don't remember when I got this sample, but it's the Moisturizing Mask by Caudalie. This stuff is beautiful if you have irritated skin. I got really dry skin on my eyelids right after having the baby and it was like my eyelids had red eyeshadow on them. They looked horrible. And I would put this on it and it would soothe them so much and I loved it and I barely need to use any so I still have a bunch in here. And I really recommend this if you have sensitive skin. Um, oh, I can hear the baby so I better hurry. I think she's okay. And I got this for my neck. Oh, got it. Right. I'm back. So the 
thing that I was about to tell you about was the Caudalie Vino Source um, SOS Intense Moisturizing Cream. This has been like highly advertised on Instagram, I noticed. I guess because I look at Caudalie, maybe the ads just come up. Um, but this is like one of their new creams that they're really promoting and it smells amazing. Oh, I just love it. It smells like you're at a, like an amazing spa or something. Um, but it's like a heavy duty cream for like irritated skin. And does it say, it just tells you how to apply it. But I got this because um, my neck has been super sensitive and the skin on my forehead has actually been really dry. Like I feel like it's severely dry sometimes. Now I'm drinking a ton of water because I am breastfeeding and it still like has not made a difference. I guess the baby is just like sucking all the hydration out of me and it's July so it's really warm where I live. So I bought this and I've just been using it like kind of spot moisturization I guess you could say because I put it all over my face the first night that I had it because my skin was so dry and it did moisturize. It wasn't overly, like it wasn't oily or anything. It was a beautiful cream. But I noticed I got just two little like kind of clogged pores right here. But they weren't like a pimple clogged pore. It was just like excessive product kind of clogged pore, if that makes sense. So now I'm careful and I'm just using it kind of as a spot treatment if I get a dry patch and as a neck cream. And I really, really like it and I recommend it. It's lovely. And then with my Caudalie order, you always get like one of these little bags full of goodies and because I made two orders I think I just shoved everything in here that I got from various orders um, but I got a sample of that cream that I just told you guys about I got a sample of the Vino Source moisturizing sorbet which I think I tried this before and I didn't love it but I can't remember this was a sample that I'm excited to try and it is their um, Caudalie Vino Perfect concentrated brightening essence so this I thought was very interesting they also have a brightening glycolic night cream I'm gonna obviously check the ingredients of these products before I use it but if they're okay for me to use while I'm breastfeeding which I think most Caudalie products are um, this t is so tempting to me a brightening glycolic night cream this I tried and I've used quite a bit of it and it is amazing and it's the SOS Thirst Quenching Serum. This felt amazing and this was one of the things that made me want to try this because this is the serum from the SOS line at Caudalie. And then I got um, these three samples and it's all that Premier Crew line, the expensive gold anti-aging line. So I got a sample of the serum that I already use, which I might save this and use it if we travel anywhere. Um, I got a sample of the cream, which I got that mini size of, and the eye cream. And I also got a sample of this, which this was a serum that I really liked like a year ago, and I almost bought it because they used it on me at Sephora. And I'm thinking that when I run out of this serum, I might switch to this one. Let me know what you guys think. This is the Vino Perfect Radiance Serum. So I'm turning 30 in a few weeks. So I don't know if I need the anti-aging one or if I could just use the Radiance one because this one is like almost half the price of this one and I'm just not sure but my skin has been amazing since October which is when I started my skincare regime that includes this so I'm kind of nervous to switch it out but this is just so expensive but I bought this multiple times because I've just been so scared to change anything so I'm probably just gonna stick with it but so far if you look at my skincare regime or skincare routine, I don't remember what I called it, but skincare video where I tell you all the products I use. My skin used to be combination oily skin, and it was when I started using that. I was acne prone and everything, and I just started that skincare routine because I was pregnant, and I had seen a video by Sephora on YouTube on this skincare routine for pregnancy skin. And I thought, well, at least that those products I know are safe. And so I slowly bought all the products in the routine, and since I've been doing that since October, I've only had two tiny, tiny blemishes. That is it. Like I got one, I think right around the time I gave birth to my daughter and I got one last week and that was it. So it could just be hormones, but I'm as terrified to switch my skincare routine steps. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I really like ordering from Caudalie because they have a great point system. 
Um, and by the way, I bought all of this with my own money because I'm crazy. But they have a really good point system. And because I bought my expensive serum there a couple times, I had enough points to get that glycolic mask for free. So that was really nice. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thanks so much for watching and I will talk to you later. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like seeing my videos, please click the subscribe button. I got a few new subscribers and I really appreciate it. I would love to grow my channel if I could. <laughs> Anyways, thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.